Well, good mornings, my Sagittarians, my cutie pies, my love bugs. I missed you guys. It seems like forever. It really does seem like forever. It's Thursday. We are doing your reading, uh, March 3rd. It's March 3rd, right? Yeah, it is March 3rd. Um, yeah, March 1st was my one year. One year of you blessing me with your presence. And I thank you from the bottom of my heart from listening to me, blah, 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 week after week. You guys are awesome. And also, if you haven't yet, and if you like my blah, 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 feel free to like and subscribe. I will really appreciate that. I really will. I really will. Okay, so we have Tarot of the dream keepers i always forget the name i always want to say dreamscape dream keepers tarot main deck and the tarot of the abyss the clarifying deck so let's see it's like christmas let's see what's underneath we have a page of wands that we know new beginning right Ooh, knight of cups piscean energy I like i like are you romancing somebody somebody romancing you but the chariot reverse and the knight of wands maybe somebody's not too sure about this though the Chariot and the Knight of Wands, but somebody's persistent, Satch. Somebody's persistent. What's this? Ace of Pentacles reverse at the bottom of the main deck and the Hierophant. It's kind of like the all knowing that this is meant to be, but it's not happening. Why is that? Seven of Swords and a Two of Pentacles. Ooh, um, that Seven of Swords actually looks like a somebody waiting. It almost looked like waiting for the right time because the Two of Pentacles and Seven of Swords is kind of hiding behind the shadows. Maybe somebody's waiting to get out of a relationship, situationship, something, something, something. Now that could just be something small for some of you out there, mini confirmations, or that could be more of what's to come. Okay, let's do this. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you are a Sag, know a Sag. Feel like being a Sag. Well, Sages, I'm glad you're here. And the reason why I say that is you could be a Sag and this can resonate. You could be a Virgo. You could be an Aquarius, who I'm doing next. Ooh, that sounded naughty. I'm doing Aquarius next. Um, yeah, no, you can you can be other signs and but dealing with a Sag and it will resonate as your main story. Okay, or it could, I should say. General energy for my Sagittarians. General energy for my Sagittarians. That feels good. You feel good, Sag. You feel good. What's the general energy? What is the general energy? What is the general energy? General energy. The page of swords. See, I felt this. You know why? Because here. This is a seven of swords trying to get away with something. I'm not feeling a sinister energy on this one though. I feel like somebody's just trying to get away with something. They're in the shadows. What they're watching. And I just feel like with this two of pentacles waiting for the right time. I got that. Who's out there? Who's waiting for the right time to, to maybe pull themselves away from something to start something else. There is somebody watching our Sag. Somebody here. I mean, look at that intensely. The guy is like super stalker mode, but I feel like it's kind of a good stalker if there's such a thing. Five of Cups reverse. This Sag is focused on new love. You know, the Five of Cups traditionally is somebody focused on the Three of Cups gone, which is the past. Two of Cups behind him. Um, and he's not looking at it. This is reversed. So this is scorpionic energy first and foremost, but it's just now focused on the new love, page of swords, waiting for the right time. To what though? To come together, to renew judgment. Ten of swords reversed so they can let something go. Four swords reversed. It's causing them a lot of anxiety. The sun and the hermit. Somebody, look at that. To get away. Okay, let's keep going. What's influencing this for our Sagittarians? What's influencing the page of swords and the five of cups reversed? What's influencing the page of swords and the five of cups reversed? What's influencing the Page of Swords and the Five of Cups reverse? The Page of Pentacles. Look at this new big. Ooh, it's electrifying. This is this is some sexy pexy energy. I mean, it's funny because it's a pentacle, and we have a Page of Swords, but I'm getting a Page of Wands on that. Something that really turns this person on. I mean, come here. Look at that. And the snake is all about shedding the old, so and welcoming the new, like it sheds its skin. But that's a beautiful card. Page of Pentacles is influencing a Page of Swords and a Five of Cups reverse. Maybe somebody's just getting out of something. Okay, let's, uh, what's the reason for the reading? Two pages though. What's the reason for the reading? Why are we all here today, kids? What is it? What is it? 
it is the hermit reverse i'm coming out that's what that always reminds me of the hermit reverse virgo energy yeah i think this might be a personal read i'm telling you this sounds feels so specific if you've been waiting for somebody to end something i feel like it might be ending here's why because the main reason the main if you take this away the general energy is a page of swords and a five of cups reverse somebody is clear on what they want they've probably been watching for some time and now they're ready to focus on that two of cups like i said because behind the behind the five of cups guy um is two of cups but it's reversed he's now turned around he's not focused he doesn't care about the past he only wants this two of cups and here it is what's influencing it is somebody's ready page of pentacles we have a hermit reverse somebody who's pulled themselves away is ready to come back out i feel like they pulled themselves away waiting for a right time maybe they could have been healing this this definitely feels new it's so far it's feeling new knock on wood so far sag but we know your readings that that pesky old energy has to creep back in seriously look at this guy he's like watching this all go down what's in the past what's in the past sagittarians what's in the past what's in the past what's in the past it is the sun reverse a delay i'm not getting anything but a delay on that this is the sun reverse is it feels like a delay to get something off the ground and i keep feeling because somebody was in a relationship what is on the sagittarians mind what is on the Sagittarian's mind? What is on the Sagittarian's mind? What is it? It is, yes, Five of Pentacles reverse, Taurian energy. So far, so good. We got one more card. Let's not jinx it. This is somebody finally getting in their sun. Five of Pentacles reverse. Some of you, what I actually feel is some money coming in. Now, could it be a settlement? If you're waiting for a settlement, I actually feel the reverse is something maybe you were you know if, if it was like a divorce proceeding and you're awaiting i do feel like remember that judgment i saw i feel like uh it might go in your favor here because this is something maybe you didn't count on but yet it, it favors you that's just what i get i'm getting that near future for my sagittarians near future for my sagittarians one more card that's not jinx it near future near future near future near future what is it what is it what is it Ugh. I'm too afraid to pick it. I'm honestly afraid. I want it to be picked. You're like, just pick it already. I can't. I don't know. I'm too afraid. Okay, that one. That one. That one. That one. Oh, I knew it. It's a page of wands reverse. Ugh. But we do have a ten of pentacles, but we have a ten of wands. Queen of pentacles reverse and a ten of cups reverse. I am telling you, somebody's dealing with somebody who's already in a relationship and it's not very happy. And the sun reverse feels like it's going to happen. Page of Pentacles, I want to start this. Page of Swords is making sure somebody else is still available. That's what I'm feeling. I'm ready to do this. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. But I got to do one more dance with the devil over here. And then I'll release myself. High Priestess reverse. I feel like it's close. I do feel like it's close. If you're waiting on a relationship to become available, I do feel like it's close. Ten of Pentacles and a Ten of Wands. Tens mean almost to completion. And this Ten of Wands, I feel like somebody is just pushing through because what they want is a Ten of Pentacles with you. Ooh, look at me have mad rhymes like that. So Ten of, but here's our third Ten. I know, crazy, right? Ten of Cups reverse and the Queen of Pentacles reverse. Somebody is just, I feel like this Queen of Pentacles reverse is anxiety because see those little cute little rabbits? See them? Yeah, they're way down there. Rabbits re represent nervous energy. So when it's upright a queen, she's in control of her anxiety. You know, it doesn't make her decision. She's not, you know, she's just in control. Not saying she doesn't have it. She just doesn't let it dictate it. This is somebody who's really, really nervous. Now the rabbits are on the top of the card. Her, her mind is down here. They're kind of running the show. What I feel is because this is how I'm feeling this, okay? I feel like there's a Sag, maybe only one out there today, this week, who's dealing with somebody who is in a relationship. This other person is probably single or more available. Let's put it that way. They're more available. But there's a Sag who's trying so hard to kind of tie up loose ends because they're, they're afraid that the other person who's available is going to leave them. And they have anxiety because this feels like the person who's attached, it's a queen, it's married, and with the devil, it's trying to get loose from this. 
And this Five of Pentacles reverse, maybe they're waiting on to save up more money or a settlement to come through. Ten of Wands and a Ten of Pentacles, they want to start something new, but they're still burdened with the old. Really getting that strongly. And where they're at, they're very, very unhappy. And they're worried that you might get away. So if you're a Sag that's single and you're dealing with somebody who's not... I think they're worried you're going to get away by the time they're free. Does that make sense? That's just one. Of, that's the story I'm getting. Page of Wands reverses near future. I feel like this is the per, like Sag. Like once again, if you're the one single, I feel the near future energies. They're worried that you won't be. You won't be by the time they're they're free. That is the story I'm getting. Okay, and I feel like the Seven of Swords isn't a negative energy. Surprisingly enough. Is somebody who's trying to sneak away from a previous situation trying to be super you know because if it is a very toxic because the devil card was there you know they don't want to know that you're waiting for them they don't they they're trying to preserve they're trying to keep that balance and get out of what this is this hierophant and ace of pentacles reverse something that's no longer growing again and eight of, it's not working in their relationship eight of pentacles reverse and this person's ready i feel almost like getting des desperate with that queen of pentacles reverse is three of wands reverse is no longer waiting or they're afraid that you're not going to wait for them they're really afraid you're not going to wait for them so okay let's clarify this what is the page of swords and the five of cups reverse influenced by the page of pentacles what is the page of cups reverse i say swords or page of okay let's start over five of cups reverse page of swords upright this is this is too much for my brain already what is the page of swords upright the five of cups reverse influenced by the page of pentacles upright and this is this i feel like if whoever is in a relationship i almost want to say it's both though um the single and the one tied up but this feels like the person who's been in a relationship this is what you do to them this they feel alive again they just they want more of that they they're afraid they're going to lose you by putting you on hold okay page of swords five of cups reverse influenced by the page of pentacles they want they want that ten of pentacles with you but they're in a ten of wands okay what is that five of cups reverse and the page of swords and a page of pentacles influence and a page of and the nine of pentacles they're like i'm almost there i'm almost free see how the bird in the hand I feel like that's what they are saying is to let you know they're almost free. Queen of Pentacles reverse. I, once again, it's reverse. I feel like they have a lot of anxiety that you might cut them out. Queen of Swords reverse and get tired of waiting. Five of Wands and the Six of Pentacles reverse. They're in a situation that might be a lot of fighting, lack of give and take, lack of happiness, to tell you the truth. Because here's the sun. I said this, that. And I think this is what you brought to their life and they are afraid to lose you what is the hermit reverse the reason for the reading it is the ten of cups they're wanting to do this they want to tell i feel like this person wants to tell the world about you but they everything feels very secretive that's why we saw the hell the hella <laughs> the high priestess reverse <laughs> She does need a new name. That would be cool. Uh, the Hella Priestess reverse. Okay. Three of Pentacles and the Devil. This person is holding on to you like you're their last lifeline, Sag. And they are so afraid. King of Cups and a King of Swords. This is, I mean, this is some serious love. They're really clear that you're the one. Wheel of Fortune. They want to move this on. But somebody has a lot of turmoil. Unbalanced and Ace of Pentacles reverse. So, there's your card reverse and ace of pentacles reverse that this just can't grow right now because i there's just somebody else in the picture still okay what is this sun reverse in the past tell me about the sun reversed over here in the past leo energy the sun reversed so the sun reversed in the past it is the empress reverse this is somebody who wants to grow you know what i just got in my head for all of you okay so be, before i go into that empress reverse is somebody who wants to grow but they they're not able to right now so they might be in a little bit of a depression and and sad i mean not a little i feel like they're very sad sad state with the sun reverse and the empress reverse they're just waiting for that right time so they can expand but i feel like this is somebody now this is really maybe somebody out just one person out there who 
wants to have your babies. Empress is also somebody who gives birth, right? And that's just popped in my head and it's not something that normally pops in my head when I see the Empress. But in this case, dealing with this level of emotions, this person is just like with the 10 of cups and the 10 of pentacles, which is legacy and family and happiness. I think this person wants to create a family with it's like somebody wants to knock somebody up. Let's just put it that way. What is the Five of Pentacles reverse on Sagittarian's mind? Five of Pentacles reverse on Sagittarian's mind. Five of Pentacles reverse on Sagittarian's mind. It's three of, yeah, three of Pentacles reverse. Capricorn energy. Somebody's waiting for the right time to probably sneak away to release this in a balanced way. Not sneak away, but you know in a very balanced way because they're just holding on and then they're waiting for the right time so they can finally release this and let go because it's no longer working. Five of Pentacles reverses. I feel like you brought the sun to their life. You brought happiness to their life. You made them feel alive again. And they're just in the dark, dark place like this, all the darkness around this card. They're just in a really dark place. What is the Page of Wands reverse in the near future for my Sagittarians? What is the Page of Wands reverse in the near future? What is this Page of Wands reverse in the near future? Page of Wands. There it is. It is now the King of Pentacles. We saw two Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. I just feel like they're so afraid you won't want them. Or, or you're going to start growing somewhere else. See how she's got that? I just feel like they, they see the potential in this, but... You're just afraid. And again, I could be reading for from a Sagittarian's point of view. You could be a Sag who's in something and you're waiting for the right time. And you're worried about the person that you really want to be with is going to either get tired of waiting or somebody else is going to come along by the time you get free. And it's just not going to, it's just not going to be, you're going to miss out because Page of Wands reverse again. And the, yeah, exactly. My gosh, this is telling such a clear story. I love it. A page of wands reverse and the hanged one reverse, which is the hangman. That's your energy. And this is a, Pis a Piscean energy. And this is Pisces. We have a lot of Pisces, I think. I thought we did. I thought I saw it. Maybe it was with the cards that were falling out. That's definitely Pisces. Here's Pisces. But the hanged one reverse. By the time you get free, the page of wands, the opportunity is already gone. I just feel like this is what somebody's really worried about. Ten of swords and the nine of swords reverse. And it's facing the truth. The Ten of Swords is facing the truth and the Nine of Swords reverse. This actually, I feel like is the other person. I feel like if, okay, if you are a Sagittarius out there and this sounds like your story, but you're the single Sagittarius, I think this, this is your card. This is a message for you. This is to relieve their pain. Ten of Swords is to say, I'm here. I feel like this, somebody needs confirmation that you're not going anywhere. That's just for whoever's the one who is not, whoever's the one waiting on somebody to get free, I feel like the person who's trying to get loose, I think they need confirmation that you're not going anywhere. That's for the other, that's like the, I mean, maybe you're a cross watcher in your own reading, or maybe you're the one Sag trying to get free to be with this water sign. I mean, there's a lot of water here. It could be earth too, but I'm, I'm getting like a water sign. So yeah, that's what I have for you, my dears. Good luck with this, whoever story this is. Um, I am doing bonus reads. Did I mention that? I'm doing bonus reads again on Sunday. So I may or may not see, see you Sagittarius, but yeah, I love you guys. Have a great week.